All right. See some good movement right here. Some bait in the water. See some stuff dying on the bait, eating the bait. Hopefully we can do this real quick and get back on the road. Um, saw some very good reports last night about trout being caught out there in the 91st Street Pier. So hopefully, that means we got a lot of good activity going on this morning. Oh my God, I just hit the mother load. This is awesome. This is awesome, awesome, awesome. Wow. One freaking cast. One cast. Just money shot. Everybody, welcome back. Ruben with Texas All Water Fishing, aka Funk Soul Brother. I'm out here today with Christopher. Hi. Let me see that shirt, Christopher. Oh yeah. Christopher and I are second day of a fishing trip that we're doing. Uh, we spent a few hours earlier this week at the Texas City Dyke, but we're back out here today. We're out here today in Galveston. We the water is really flat. Clarity is probably about two feet, maybe two and a half feet. Um, some gentlemen next to us are catching some nice specks on some shrimp. Christopher and I stopped this morning. We tossed the cast net. Today we're going to be targeting some shark with some of the finger mullets. So hopefully we'll hook up to some nice sharks. So stay tuned and thanks for coming back. Now I'm going to throw this guy, pin this guy on top by his, hook this guy top on the, by the dorsal fin. Because Christopher is fishing on top water. So I want him kind of trying to swim down a little bit. There we go. There you go, Christopher. I'm pre-lining my mullet with a little chatter weight on him. I have a hook to the... Oh, set your hook! Set your hook! Set your hook! Real, 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 Is he still there? Real, real, real. Do you see him fighting? Yeah. Okay, real, 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 real. Keep coming. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Awesome, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. That's gonna be a big one. Come on, walk with me, walk with me. Keep coming, keep him tight. Walk with me, come on out. We're going out of the water. We're going out of the water with him. Keep coming, keep coming. We don't have a net, so we need to get him out of the water. Keep coming, keep him coming. All right, keep coming, stay calm, stay calm. It's a shark. Come on, Maybe keep coming. Yeah, it's all right. It's a baby black tip, looks like it. Keep coming. Keep coming. Keep coming, don't row no more, don't row no more. You have enough enough line already. We're just gonna walk them all the way out. Oh. I can't believe I caught a shark. amazing. Go put a little bit more water in the bait bucket here. He's not dead. Get on this side. I'll get you in the video with him. He's not dead. <clears throat> there he goes. There he goes. Come on. Relax. Relax. <clears throat> Look at me. Look at me. All right. Look at me. So this is Christopher's black tip shark right here. You can see that there. That young man did a fabulous shark job. You can touch him, yeah. It's okay. I'm not too sure what kind of shark it is. He has black tips. It might be a spinner shark. All right. What's a spinner shark? It's close to a black tip. Very similar. We're going to release him. Come on. Let's watch, Let's watch my dad release him. There he goes. Watch. He's going the right way. He knows where to go. Yep, you can see his spin time. Can I reach that? Maybe about two feet, two feet of clarity. Christopher! 
<laughs> that was another shark. Yes, he came all the way out the air, and you you're, you're lost your your. He took your shrimp here. I mean your mullet here. Hold the mine. There he goes. Another shark. Let's walk out. Another shark. I tell you, there's a lot of shark out here today. Christopher. Yeah. Come in. All right, so I got to do a battery change. So, excuse the, excuse the audio, I got to do a battery change. But, um... So I just caught this little guy right here, another small shark, it's probably maybe around 18, 20 inches. Here, hold this. Okay. This is beautiful. All right, let's get this way. Yeah. Yeah, he had a, he's caught three. Two of them got off, but yeah, this little guy I just hooked up with. That's all, the little baby shark. Baby shark, doo 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 doo, -doo baby shark, doo. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're gonna let him go. Let's go watch. Looks like he's ready to go home. Yeah, he's ready to go. He's ready to go, he's ready to go. Let's watch him. Ding. Come on, little buddy. Ding, 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 ding. Sorry, I forgot to push to hit record. But come on, keep backing up. There you go. You don't have a net. The safest way to do when you're out here weight fishing, catch a shark, is just back up and bring it into your, bring it into the bank. Keep coming back. Keep coming back. You can re wrangle this one in by yourself. Come on. It's okay. Watch it. Come on. Keep bagging up. Keep bagging up. Watch your line. What's your shark doing? Come on. I know. I felt the figure that's what it was. Come on. All right, let me go get the pliers. So Christopher, this is his second shark landed, yeah, and his fourth shark he's hooked up with. Yeah, because one got off, one broke off, and now he just landed the yeah. first one with Dad's help. This one he landed all by himself. There we go. Got one on. Fish on. Fish on. Right where those pelicans were. Can you help me? Let's see what he is. Oh, a speck. Nice speck of trout. It's a little undersized though, small guy, but he is still a speckler. There we go. Nice little dink, but he'll get bigger and hopefully we'll catch his brother. Get it, get it, get it, get it. It broke. Oh no. What? It broke off? Where is it? It broke off. He's swimming with your bobber. Stop, don't roll in too much. Your line broke. All right, guys, so that's going to wrap it up today. Christopher and myself, we came out, surfed, uh, Wade fish to surf a little bit this morning. We started off the day trying to target some shark and uh, through the cast and they caught some live mullet. With the mullet, Christopher, what did you get? Two, sh two sharks. He got two sharks. And how many did you lose? Um, two or two. three? Two. He lost two. Some gentlemen were nice enough to give us um, some, live, some live shrimp. And with the live shrimp, I caught uh, dink little speckle trout and Christopher had what I'm assuming was a pretty good size speckle trout.
because it was pulling drag. It wasn't fighting like the sharks were, where they'd come up and, and jump out of the water. It was pulling a lot of drag, uh, very similar to what you would catch for an upper slot uh, speckled trout. And unfortunately, um, his line popped. How do you feel about losing that fish? Um, bad. Is that a bummer? Mm -hmm. But at least now we know that Spolly, that we should fish there because that big old thing or what or that what my dad said what he what he's assumed there that means there's a lot of good fish there so that's why we stayed there stayed there yeah but it got a little late in the day and the bite went away um there's really nothing biting a couple small stuff but you know what we had a great time on the water christopher and i made another memory together so that's what it's all about memories and experience this is his first time weight fishing uh, so he was able to come out here, wait fish a little while, gain some experience, throwing the popping cork and popping the cork and trying to get the fish to bite. But hey, if you haven't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to push the notification button. Let you know the next time I upload a video. Again, Ruben, Texas All Water Fishing. Thanks again. Thanks a lot. Hopefully next time you'll catch me hooking up. Bye. And also go watch Christopher's Toy Box. Christopher has a YouTube channel called Christopher's Toy Box. Go check it out. The link will be below. Thanks.